there, my Leos, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of December the 3rd through to the 9th. I went ahead, shuffled the cards, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for my Leos. First up, we have the Ace of Wands in the upright, followed then by the Queen of Swords reversed. And next, we have the Knight of Swords reversed, followed then by Major Arcana the Hermit <laughs> reversed. And lastly, we have the Five of Cups in the reverse. Okay, let's see what's going on for Leo. For the overall energy, you have that of the Ace of Wands in the upright position. The Ace of Wands, all, all of the Aces basically represent a new beginning. Now, with the Wand energy, it governs a lot of things. Anything from travel to uh, business to um, uh, activity, uh, movement, action. So, uh, the Ace of Wands for me, basically can represent, say some of you could be uh, coming up with a brilliant new idea. Maybe something happens that comes out of the anti-cosmos, somebody could be saying something, you could see something on a video, say on YouTube, or you could get a great idea from reading something um, in the paper, or just getting a great idea in general from somewhere. It's going to be different for all of you because this is just a general read. So take it for what it applies but there is a new opportunity for some of you it could be for travel uh it could be for a new business idea a new spark something that's really exciting could be a passionate new relationship for some of you there is uh, a lot of passion and excitement that is connected to this card so uh it's going to be something that's going to be very exciting to you anyway the idea and the opportunity could be just sort of dropping in your your lap now coming right off the hop we have the energies of the queen of swords in the reverse position now this is air energy uh that of gemini libra aquarius sun moon arising male or female um i'm not sure what's going on with you leos but you've been getting a lot of air energy in the reverse lately you'll have to leave a comment in the comment section below if this is resonating for you but the queen of swords in the reverse position can sometimes indicate a cutoff in communication with somebody now it could be the air sign perhaps uh, cut off communication with you or you have cut off the communication with that person or it could just be representing a shutdown in communication or bad communication sometimes this can uh, represent um, uh, communication that comes through that isn't even exactly the truth a lot of times the sword energy when it is reversed this can represent either deception or lies being told uh, so be careful with that energy um, so yeah you've got that going on and it's paired up with a more air energy Gemini Libra Aquarius this time it's the Knight of Swords in the reverse position uh, Knights generally bring in offers um, it could be a, a verbal offer or written offer that you could be expecting um, with the Mercury retrograde a lot of things were delayed or held up for some reason or another it could be that for some of you maybe you were expecting a message or something to come through from not necessarily an air sign could be anybody um, and it's it's supposed to be coming through to you but it's not for some reason the information is being delayed and the offer is being delayed now moving on towards the weekend we have the energies of the uh, hermit in the reverse position when the card is in the upright this is where we're dealing with solitary energy where we're just sort of going within to either do some self analysis or self uh, reflection or even to go within to study maybe some of you are have been spending some time in solitude uh, doing research or studying uh, some of the students out there now when it's in the reverse like this you could be maybe uh, taking a break over the month of December and you're no longer studying so you're coming out and becoming more sociable for others of you you're no longer researching or waiting for to resolve a situation you're just sort of done with that energy now you are ready to move out and to become the social creatures that you are <laughs> Leo's are very sociable you guys do like to mix with others and that's nice to see that card there for you 
And the last card you have up is the Five of Cups in the reverse position. This energy is much better inverted as opposed to upright. When it is upright, this can represent a bit of a pity party where we're still crying over something that happened, a loss, a disappointment, that type of uh, situation. When it's inverted like this, we're starting to heal. The healing process has begun. Maybe that's why some of you could have been sort of hiding yourselves away due to a situation that could have been going ongoing for a while and now you've just sort of come to terms with it and now you're no longer upset or um you know uh still dwelling in the uh, disappointment of it all you're sort of now coming to terms with it and you're starting the healing process very good energy i like this uh exciting energy for you this new new beginning this new prospect of something so i hope this reading helped you leo if it did please feel free to like share and subscribe otherwise i'll see you next week bye bye for now